Did you know that 75% of the people watching this channel do not subscribe? What? Is that right? Kya hai ye? Aap apne professor ko bina subscribe kare kaise dekh sakte hain? Aapke saath kya galat hua hai? Aapko pata hai? Aapke professor aapse pyar karte hain? Jo aapko sahi lage wahi kijiye. Aur movie community college ko subscribe kijiye. Well, hey, what's up, everybody? How are you? Um, thank you so much for watching. Danyavad for watching. Um, I really appreciate it. Uh, Superbot, it is 5, uh, 5 a.m., 4 a.m., something like that. Uh, uh, everybody's working for the weekend. It is the weekend, and here we are. And um, I just want to say thank you. I want to say thank you to all my Hindu friends um, who have really, really helped me tremendously. Um, I have to say before I started doing this channel, if you said to me, what is India? It's weird. Like, it just, it looks weird. You know, all these colors, loud, strange food, uh, strange sounds, sitar, I don't know. But man, how much of this has just, just changed me, like inwardly just that now I, I just I really am a fan of the culture and, and, and we'll even see like you know we'll get comments that people are like hey what the hell dude where's the movie stuff all you do is Indian culture I kind of like it I, I don't I'm sorry I kind of like it and uh, and plus too like it's it's just I don't know I find it fascinating I find it fascinating and um, excuse me I'm really tired I, I, I got some health issues going on here nothing serious nothing serious um, I gotta go in uh, this week versus first uh, an ultrasound kind of thing on my my neck let me see what happens I don't know I don't think it's a big deal but why is my eye my eyes like sticking dude oh 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 anyways I'm a dork right I'm a dork uh, let's take a look at this. This is 10 unique facts about Hinduism. This is part two. I've reacted to the first one. This is FTD. This is Leroy. Leroy and the fellas. Let's take a look. The secret of Hinduism is actual attachment to the Interesting. Interesting. In the history of mankind, many cultures have come and gone, but Hinduism has stood the test of time and has managed to spread all over the world. Despite being the world's third largest and oldest religion, many people are unaware of some of the basic facts about the religion. Welcome back to another episode of FTD Facts. My name is Leroy Kenton, and if you haven't seen part one in our Hinduism Facts series, I recommend checking it out and then coming back to this one. The link to that is down below. And now the question that I have for you before we get into all the facts is, what comes to mind when you hear the word Hinduism. India. Is it all India. the gods? Is it India? Is it yoga? Let me know down below. Now the term Dharma, which means righteousness, Artha, which means money, Kama, that means the right desire, and Moksha, meaning salvation, make up the four main life goals of Hinduism. The goal of life in Hinduism is to attain salvation or Moksha. Self-realization and freedom from the cycle of death and rebirth is the final goal. In Hinduism, there's also the belief in a circular concept of life rather than a linear concept of life. Time is divided into four ages. The Satya Yuga, the golden age of innocence, Tretha Yuga, so Dwapara like, Yuga, and destroyer. Kali Yuga. In Hindu cosmology, it's believed that their universe is created and destroyed in a cycle of every 4.32 billion years. Quite interestingly enough, that also does coincide with many scientists and in their beliefs of the date of this Earth. Although that is way in the realm of speculation, it was just interesting to note the two similarities here. Okay, so let's move on to the major books of Hinduism. We have the Vedas, Ramayana, Bhagavad Gita, 18 Puranas, and the Mahabharata. Now, the Vedas are the central book in Hinduism. Lord Brahma is credited with the composition of the Vedas, which were passed down from the great sages to their disciples. 
There are four Vedas, the Rig Veda, Yajur Veda, Sama Veda, and the Atharva Veda. The Mahabharata, one of the major religious texts in Hinduism, is also the longest epic poem in the world and is also described as the longest poem ever written. The longest version of the Mahabharata consists of over 10,000 shlokas or 200,000 individual verse lines. About 1.8 million words in total, the Mahabharata is roughly 10 times the length of the Iliad and the Odyssey combined. Now as you know, in our world today, gender equality is a huge topic. So let's talk a little bit about gender equality in Hinduism. Well, in terms of gender equality with their gods, Hinduism is perhaps the only religion which boasts of an almost equal number of male and female deities. And in Hinduism, deities of both gender are worshipped with equal passion. Also, Hinduism is one of the few religions that does not consider the pursuit of wealth a sin. And if you guys are familiar with Hinduism, Lakshmi, the goddess of wealth, both material and spiritual, is a testament to that fact in Hinduism. Now guys, did you know that Hinduism promotes organ donation? The first example of organ donation in the world can be found in Hindu mythology. Sage Dadichi, who happily donated his bones so that Lord Indra could use them to create a weapon, the Vajra, to kill demons. For those of you who also may be familiar with plant-based treatments, Ayurveda, the plant-based medical treatment practice, has its roots from Hinduism. The largest Hindu temple in the world is surprisingly not in India. Really? So where is it? It's actually located in Angkor, Cambodia. Hinduism has spread across many countries over the years, especially in Nepal, Bangladesh, Myanmar, Malaysia, Cambodia, Indonesia, Thailand, and other Southeast Asian countries. The people following Hinduism around the world are approximately 1 billion people, which is about 14% of the world's population. That is a huge chunk of the population. And that concludes our second episode on Hinduism. Pretty short and sweet. Again, I do have the link below to part one if you haven't. Yeah, okay, Leroy. You got it, buddy. Um, very interesting. You know, it is um, what to do with the curious case of Hindus, right? It is a, um, a compelling story. It is a compelling culture. It is a um, likable story, a likable culture. What to do with this? Hmm. That is the question. And if so, who answers? Who answers? I just broke into Pearl Jam. But um, very good. Very good. Yeah, I know some of you guys don't like FTD. And when they just do like Indian stuff, it looks, they, I think they do a good job, but sometimes, yeah, I, I, whatever, I know, everybody knows, everybody knows, I ain't gonna say nothing, but very good, uh, I enjoyed that, man, I got a lot to think about, I really do, all right, I'll catch you guys later, peace and much love. I want to say, all the people, please subscribe, movie, community, college. God bless you, brother. Keep it up. You're making really, really great video. And please subscribe my CWV YouTube channel too. God bless you. Thanks for supporting me. I love you. Your name really, really very Inuit, Inuit professor.